हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज निखिल नागर एंड आई विल टीच यू द स्टेड प्रो दैट हाउ वी डिजाइन अवर स्ट्रक्चर इन स्टेड प्रो सॉफ्टवेयर एंड फर्दर वी विल डिस्कस द मेन थिंग्स दैट विल कम इन अवर स्टेड प्रो सो दिस इज अवर इंट्रोडक्शन लेक्चर तो मैं बताना चाहता हूँ कि हम आगे अभी कौन कौन सा टॉपिक करना चाहेंगे इसके अंदर लाइक हाउ टू मॉडल अवर स्ट्रक्चर सो यू कैन सी इन दिस स्टेट प्रो मेन विंडो देर आर मैनी थिंग्स मैनी टैप्स यू कैन क्लिक एंड ओपन दैन थिंग्स लाइक जोमेट्री फर्स्ट वी विल मेक अवर जोमेट्री सो दे आर मैनी ऑफ ऑपरेशन दैट विल हेल्प टू अवर जोमेट्री फॉर्मेशन and then we can change our view these are zoom window display wall structure zoom out zoom in and the isometric view this is our top view as per the click on top view you can see x y z axis from the top x and z axis you can see and bottom view these are colored face which will denote the face of our structure these are rotations if you have an if you don't have any mouse then you can use these operation to rotate our structure about the this axis about this axis about vertical axis and about the z axis so this is your view window in which you can see your 3d rendering view also here the 3d render view is available if you want to see your 3d render for your structure then click on it and you can see the structure then this is our select bar so as per the select bar if we don't use any cursor because here are four cursors are available so if you don't use any cursor then the by default on the window the beam cursor is assigned if you want to select any beam like uh, i create a beam by geometry tab give the ordinate we will discuss it further so don't panic like this is our beam now i want to select it so for the selection we use our mouse cursor and simply select our beam because the by default the beam cursor is beam cursor is also by default is taken by the software if you want to select any nodes so you can see there are two nodes so you can't select this node because the cursor is beam by default the beam cursor is available here so you have to use node cursor so for the selection now the node can be selected and this node also select if you want to select more than one node so select this node and press on control and select on another node so both nodes are selected with one way this is your coordinates of the structure as we can select this beam due to the default beam cursor and to select the node cursor we have to choose the node cursor as well as to choose any plate we have to use plate cursor also here so this type of logo on our cursor will be shown and to select any solid plate so you have to use this solid cursor also so as we go further these type of specifications here you can see the supports fix support pin support and custom in which we have to create any support as per our requirements and this is the loading type of loading here you can see many parts of the loading vehicle load wind load and then we go to the analyze and after the analyze we check our there is no error should be present in our structure and then we go to the design and finally we will design our structure and the project is complete so in this way we will go on in throughout our this course
from step one geometry to and then assigning properties material specifications supports and then give the loading analysis and design by selecting our code and some other things that are import important like post processing and the design of foundation and advanced concrete design this will also be covered in this course so thank you